Did you attend this year's PCMA CIC 19 in Quebec City? Or perhaps you'd like to take a look at what happened at this year's event. Today I'm doing my recap, so stick around. Hey folks, it's Leanne and I'm recently returned from PCMA's Canadian Innovation Conference in Quebec City, November 17 to 19. And it was a phenomenal event. This conference really is a highlight of my year now with my first being uh, last year, 2018 in Victoria, BC. And now Quebec City has really set the bar high for future CICs to come. So I want to show you a little bit about what they did at this year's event that made it so phenomenal. The theme for this year's event was reimagine and boy did they ever do that. They really pushed the envelope and reimagined what a conventional conference has looked like. And I'm going to show you a few ways that they did that. Firstly was the general session or main plenary room. This is the first impression of the conference when you arrive. And it was incredible. I didn't take really great pictures, but it was actually set with the main stage being in the middle of the room with all of the round tables surrounding the main stage. They also had two stages off to two of the sides of the, the room as well. Um, but having everything in the center of the room was really a unique way to do it. But the biggest impact was the AV. So AV screens circled the room and so anywhere you looked you could get a clear shot of the screen and the opening visuals for the event were incredible it bounced around all throughout the screens in the room and freeman av really did a phenomenal job of the audio visuals especially in the plenary room the second thing that quebec city really reimagined were the breakout rooms all the breakout rooms were themed after a video game that was produced in Quebec City. Not sure if you knew this about Quebec City, but they are a technology hub and they do a lot of game development. I don't play video games myself, but the rooms were phenomenal and it really led to the fun of the event, the innovation of Quebec City and the uniqueness of the destination in each and every room. So I got a real good kick out of the breakout rooms. They were really colorful, really playful, and a great way to showcase the destination. The conference really delivered strong content throughout the week. From keynote speakers like Peter Katz, Mark Bowden, Frank Warren, the conference really delivered strong breakout sessions as well. So you were never without an opportunity to learn something new or engage in a topic that was meaningful for your industry. I really enjoyed all the activations that this year's conference committee implemented as well. There was the HECA Health Walking Challenge in collaboration with Caesars Forum. There was the gamification where people could answer trivia questions, etc. about the industry, as well as the really innovative food art that they did at the Tuesday plenary, where these two food artists literally created the morning's coffee break food um, in an extremely artistic way, set to music, and then the plates were broken up and brought into the foyer for us to enjoy. Really cool, really, as event profs, we always go to these events for the great networking, and Quebec City really set the scene for some great networking events. The opening reception was held at the Hilton Quebec. The food was phenomenal. The Custom drinks were spectacular, and the entertainment was simple and elegant. I had a really good time at that opening reception. The closing dinner and show at the Voltaire de Quebec Armory was beautiful. The venue itself is gorgeous, and then the food was magnificent, probably some of the best conference food I've ever had. And then they brought out the entertainment, which was the Pesho production team, it's a family affair and they were just phenomenal. They were funny, they were of course talented, and it was a great way to end off this incredible event in Quebec City. And finally, one of the greatest highlights for me for this event was I had the great opportunity to speak on a couple of occasions. I did a panel session with my colleagues and friends, Candace and Sean, and then I did a session on my own about inbound marketing. And this was really one of the first events that I could put together something 
and deliver content that I was very passionate about. And I can't thank the organizing committee enough for taking a risk on my content and allowing me to share it with the Canadian industry. A huge thank you to the conference chairs, Krista Cameron and Heather Reed, for putting together a phenomenal team, putting together a phenomenal event. Krista, thank you for all of your service throughout the years at the PCMA conferences. And Heather, I'm looking forward to what you put together next year in Edmonton. Thank yous as well to Lynn and Pat at Quebec City and the team that you put together to deliver this event. You did an amazing job. I'm such a huge fan, huge fan of Quebec City and you guys didn't disappoint and I'm so excited to return to your destination. So for those of you who attended CIC, I would love to know what your favorite part was. Please comment below this video and share it with those who didn't have opportunity to attend. All the resources, partners, and entertainment that I've mentioned throughout this video, you can find links to those resources via this video when it's posted on YouTube. So please find this video over on YouTube. You'll find all the links there and then be connected to all the great things that we saw in Quebec City. Thanks for watching everyone and I do hope to see you next year at Canadian Innovation Conference 2020 in Edmonton, November 22nd to 24th. Bye for now.